Oh my god, Logan, I was thinking about Decon 2017 all last night, and man, what an adventure. Yeah, the workshops were super interactive and informative. I learned so much. And don't you remember all the innovative cheers? Like, let's go sports! Yeah, it was so memorable, so spirited. Also, the awards made it so memorable. Yeah, we couldn't get any sleep. It was like non-stop activity. I made friendships that are gonna last me a lifetime. I'm so lucky. Oh my god, hold on. Guys, guys, there's been a serious emergency. Almost all of the point on board was kidnapped. You have to do a thorough investigation, but before you do, I found a key piece of information. Guys, do you know what this means? The point of board could probably be at the convention center. We can't make assumptions. We'll have to interrogate some suspects. Who did it? Did what? You know exactly what she's talking about. Don't play dumb with us. If you're talking about a pointed board, then it wasn't me. Aaron looks like the exact person who would do this. One of you did this, so fess up. No one is leaving until we get answers. Why the heck would we do it? We're on board too. Okay, well she's a CSI addict, so it's obviously her. No way would I do it. I'd be the last person to ever do it. If anything, it's probably That's Nina. She acts all innocent, but she's probably like secretly doing it. Yeah. Yeah, it's probably her. Why don't you question her? Why are you questioning us? Yeah, what the heck? So tell me, where were you on the night that this happened? Okay, well, I was at home, but then I was feeling really hungry. So then I went out to this boba shop and like the line was hecka packed, right? So then afterwards, I went to bed eventually after being really stressed. So who would do it then? Well, well uh, it was actually Mikey and Zach. Like, they hang out all the time and they always talk together. It is so obvious that they would do something so stupid like this. Wait, the appointed board got kidnapped. There's no clue as to where they are. Yeah, I heard about it uh, last night, right? And so far we suspect it was the LTGs, those rotten LTGs. The LTGs, they did it again. <gasps> they thought it was one of us that did it. <laughs> but we didn't. Right? But how could we? Is it CNH Cuans and Ohana? I don't trust any of you guys anymore. It's probably you, you Mikey, who did it. Zach, too, and Julie. Just confess up. Hey, what the heck? You know it's you. No, no it wasn't. Oh my god, Julie, I swear, no, it was Zach. Stop. It was you. It was you. It was you. you know what? No. Guys, guys, calm down. No, we gotta, we gotta focus. Well, what do we know about this case right now? Four of us are missing, and any one of us could have done it. I just remember executive board talking about the details. We need to get an answer now, we need tips! I'm sure the appointed board members are at the convention center. I mean, like, did you see the lanyard? It must be a sign. Wouldn't they be more likely to attack the biggest event? Yeah, we need to announce this to the public to help with this cause. There's no way we can get this done without the help of the members. Joe will make a video and publish it. Hi, this is Joe Kang, your CNHQ's District Technology Chair, and I'm reporting live with some breaking news regarding your four district appointed board members of Juliana Pantoja, Kirsten Roscoe, Larry Lamb, and Peter Nguyen. We aren't sure of their whereabouts or their safe being, but we know they were kidnapped last night at a Rancho Cucamonga office. So a formal investigation has been created in order to find who did this and who's responsible for this mishap. Um, currently, we are holding a press conference with your CNHQ and executive board. Attention all CNHQ winners, there's a serious emergency regarding your district board. Almost all of the appointed board members are missing and we suspect it was a kidnapping. We need tips to help further our investigation. Our clues lead us to believe that the appointed board members are held at the Warner Center Marriott in Woodland Hills. A formal investigation on April 6th to 8th will be made to help find our district appointed board members. Please spread the word to all CNH QNs members to help us solve this mystery. Send your tips to qins.sendtips at gmail.com. Hello, Michaela. How are you? Hey, Mr. Bashir. I've been so busy with my case lately, it's exhausting. Have you heard about it? Yeah, I actually just watched it. How's your progress going? A little better. We received a piece of evidence from Mr. Umbarger, which should really help with the investigation. Do you really trust Mr. Umbarger? I'm telling you, if it were me as the head of the investigation, the case would be closed by now. Mr. Bashir, you know that he's been one of the best investigators we've ever had. It was a blessing that he was able to find that piece so quickly. I'm aware of that, but there's going to be a time where he has to step down. And who better to replace him than me?
We'll have to get this through HQ, but yeah, I guess you're right, Mr. Bashir. All right, good. On a different note, I seem to have misplaced one of my lanyards. Do you have an extra that I can have? Uh, yeah, sure.